Happy Friday, Paul Hadley Middle School. It is Friday, January 24th, 2020, and this is the Friday video. I hope that you have had a good week. I think it has been a great week since it was a short week. I hope that everything that you do this Friday is going to be of your best ability and that you'll be able to show everybody how amazing you really are and how amazing I think you are. I think a lot of you are just fantastic human beings and I really appreciate being able to teach you in class. One of the things that happens during the school year that is on some level a little bit frustrating is the fact that during school there's a lot of stuff that we are assigned to read that we don't necessarily really love to read. I did have the chance over this long weekend to really start reading a book called The Institute by Stephen King. It's really good. It's about, uh, it's almost a young adult novel. Although it's still Stephen King, so it's not a young adult novel. I want you to tell me what it is that you are going to read for pleasure when you have a chance to read for pleasure. Come tell me what you are going to read for pleasure, and I will give you a positive action ticket this week. You guys are so good. Moriarty, super cold outside. What are you going to do for fun? Well, uh, stay inside. Yeah. Uh, I've been getting on the uh, on the old Pinterest and trying to find new recipes, and uh, my dad's really proud of that, I'm sure. Very nice. Since you're not going outside to play, what are you going to do for fun? I draw, I talk with friends, and I hang out with my cat, and sometimes I role play. I watch Disney Plus and watch YouTube. What do you watch on YouTube? Um, things. What? Things. What things? Who's your favorite YouTuber? Just Too Good. What is it? Just Too Good. Yeah. Nobody goes outside anyway. Who goes outside? <laughs> 2000 show entertainment TV series titled Unknown. So I mostly just play with my cat and watch YouTube because I have nothing better to do. I message games, I watch Disney Plus, Netflix, and I go shopping online. Me too. Disney Plus, Netflix, YouTube, texting people that don't care about me, and uh, FaceTime. She texts me. So, now that you can't go outside because it's too cold. Yeah. What do you do for fun? I play volleyball. What else do you do for fun? Sleep. Yeah. Oh. So, most of the time, I we watch I Disney Plus, too. Oh, yeah. And, then <laughs> and I, play I, smoke her, I smoke her in basketball. That's because that's the only game you will play. Oh, you know, I love going to basketball, basketball games. Like, if there's basketball games, boring. I love basketball. <laughs> or whatever it is, and ice cream together, it is so good. Trust me, you should try it. Mm, okay. I do help after school. I might need to help the Wellsprings people in Martinsville. So what do you do instead of going outside to play? Not your homework. Yes, I do. I do my homework. Listen, so right after school, I have to go to swim practice from 3 to 5. I get out about like 5, 12. Then I go home, eat, start my homework, then take shower, then I usually get in bed around 9, and then I just watch The Office for the rest of the night. That's my fun. Uh, probably the movies. Oh, what movie do you want to watch right now? Nice out. Oh, I think that's a little bit too adult, but... I watch Netflix. What do you watch on Netflix? A bunch of stuff. Like and what? I play board games. What is your favorite board game? I like Monopoly. I cheat at Monopoly. I, I do <laughs> Mr. Fugate, what yes. are you going to do because you can't go outside? I cool. still will go outside because I'm not a wuss. This is quality content. I'm going to cringe right at myself here. when I die. <laughs> <laughs> She's doing ASMR. Uh, I'm just going. Wait, okay, so it's super cold outside. I know, I forgot a coat. And you got braces. Yeah. When did that happen? Uh, Monday. Okay. 
What is the best thing to do uh, leisure activity even though it is super cold outside? I kind of just like watch Netflix or something, just like chill out, you know? You sent in Friday video questions last week and I did not get to them. Well, this week, there are a ton. If you could live in any decade, what would it be and why? I would live in this decade, in the here and now, because the world is a much better place now than it was 10 years ago, 20 years ago, or 30 years ago. It's much safer, the life expectancy is much higher, and like, I like my family, kids, wife, all those people too. I bought a house for the price of a VCR. Actually, there was a point in history where you could buy a house for the cost of a VCR when a VCR first came out. What would it feel like if Max Hedrum never existed? Probably about the same. What if the Colts never played football again? That's not funny. What if all the coffee disappeared? That too is not funny. What if football never existed? What the heck? What is your dream vacation? I took a vacation with my wife to Maine and it was just us in a cabin in a pine forest next to a lake and we didn't see anybody. It was glorious. Who's going to win the Super Bowl? The San Francisco 49ers. Have you heard of the Lego Star Wars TikTok takeover? I'm gonna be an old man and refuse to get in on the TikTok thing. Do you know when ranch day is? I have zero clue what that means. What's your favorite piece of artwork that a student has made for you? This one. Is a hot dog a sandwich? Yes. Have you ever been to McDonald's when the ice cream machine was working? Yeah, I got an M&M McFlurry. It was great. Why are there chip bags pinned to the chalkboard? Well, technically they're not pinned to the chalkboard. They're pinned to the thing above the chalkboard. And I still don't know why. Can I make a TikTok with you so we can be TikTok famous? No, I am not getting in on the TikTok thing. Can the class do a TikTok for a Friday video? No! What's your favorite Harry Potter quote? My favorite Harry Potter quote comes from book seven. Albus is talking to Harry and he says, of course it's happening inside your head, Harry. But why on earth should that mean that it's not real? Who invented language arts? Language has been studied since the beginning of studying. Do you like the song Just a Friend by Biz Marquis? I remember when that song came out and it was great then and it's still great now. What's your favorite player in football? Well, it, at one point it was Joe Montana, and then it was Peyton Manning, and then it was Andrew Luck. It used to be Reggie Wayne at one point. <sighs> Darius Leonard, I think, right now. Darius Leonard. Hey, do you know Joe? I am Joe. Would you rather not be able to drink coffee for the rest of your life or only be able to drink the same brand or flavor of coffee for the rest of your life? I don't really care uh, what brand or flavor of coffee I drink as long as I get to drink coffee and that luxurious, wonderful drink is never taken away. Never. Are you the Scranton Strangler? I don't live in Scranton. I say it all the time. I have a ton of really, really good kids in all my classes. I wanna take some time now to recognize uh, a group of students who I think are doing a fantastic job since we got back from Christmas break and have set the bar high, not only for themselves, for, but for the other people around them. So the terrific 12 this week are period one, McKenna Spangler and Bailey Young, period three, Kendall Crocker and Brindley Gilliam, period four, Alexis Weddle and Alyssa Baker, period five, Caleb Garrett and Tristan Stoddard, Period six, Kara Wilson and Owen Grimes. Period seven, Maddie Alt and Emily Jones. Thank you for being awesome kids. Thank you for making teaching just a fantastic career choice. I really enjoy my job and you are a huge, huge part of the reason why. Well done. Come get a positive action ticket for me and a pat on the back. As we walk, the, walk hall. the halls this is Friday. <laughs> Keep going. As we walk the halls this is Friday. Remember, be awesome, to be, be awesome to people around you. Make the school. Make the school a better place and have a great weekend, Paul. No, a fantastic, fantastic Friday. Friday. Fantastic Friday, Paul. Right, so what? Okay, guys, thanks for watching the video. Make sure you subscribe to this channel um, and hit that thumbs up button. Peace out.